That's good. No start on my second video of Lear's. I would do a video of Lear's, sorry. Heading towards the western side where most of the construction companies are starting from by the roundabout which was placed here <coughs> between 2004 and 2005 to ease the number of accidents because a lot of accidents used to take place here the last accident that took place here was in 2005 2004 the 25th of december 24th of december and someone died people died as a result of it so they decided to build a roundabout here but years ago lots of accidents and uh, accidents due to take place out here walking towards the construction companies in a western direction So this road will be back to C.O. Williams Construction Company and back to Ready Mix and Preconco Limited, all construction companies. So looking back to the world, the Roberts Manufacturing Company, which is at Lower Estate in St. George. So this road had been recently paved, it, had been, it, it, it was closed for a while, now it has been opened back to vehicular traffic. So this is all layers you got. So the road has been paved uh, finally. <coughs> so CO Williams stands for Cow. CO Williams stands for Charles Offney Williams, but we in Barbados refer to him as Cow Williams. He and his brother Ralph Busy Williams have lots of businesses in Barbados. Carl Williams died in 2020, 2021, but his children are still running the business for him. children still run the business. Carl Williams also has lots of land around Barbados as well. <clears throat> all the land here, all the houses that are built here. You can see Roberts Manufacturing Company again at Lower Estate. St. George. So all here was Lear's plantation is always also around this area as well. So either here or Jack and the Box Billy can be the two alternative routes to get around without using the busy highway in traffic. <coughs> These can be two alternate routes to 
get her own Barbados. Atlantic trading here. Atlantic trading here. Atlantic trading here. Yeah. So it's all paved and well paved the road is. They are now they are doing the road in Turnpike in St. George, the one leading from Buckley to Boarded Hall. They are doing work on that road as well. I don't know if it's still open if it has been open back either. <coughs> The road has been well paved. Atlantic trading, Atlantic marketing, sorry. Atlantic marketing. At the Darrow's Commercial Park. The all run by Paul's Enterprises. And the ready mix construction company up here as well. All the Atlantic marketing. It is owned by, I think it is owned by Paul Enterprises. Ready Mitch Construction Company is also here. The first construction company. The first construction company <coughs> of you approaching. Ready mix construction company up here. This is all farmland here as well. Yes, there is no passing ready mix construction company at Lears at Lears Gap. Ready mix and ready block. I can see all the construction trucks. Ready mix is you want some of the, some of the people who have built our nation's roads. Ready mix and ready block here. Let's go. Ready mix and ready block construction company. Back up the road. All layers at Michael.
So this will be by the St. Thomas with Baby's Lane, Kingwood, and that area. All land and farmland. So now up coming the C.O. Williams Construction Company, which is owned by Cow Williams. He has died he has died but his family, his sons and so on still run the business. Yesterday I showed you guys his brother's place at King Garden, which is Ralph Busy Williams, his place, Williams Metals on the Williams Complex. So I'm now showing you Williams his, his brother I'm showing you now the construction company. Williams Meadows and Akian Garden is also in close proximity to this area where I am. So I'm now approaching the C.O. Williams Construction Company. This is the Carl Williams, C.O. Williams. Construction Company here. Because of the time, this walk is time consuming at the moment. So because of time, pre Concord Limited is also in here. I oh, don't go all the way. Oh. The moment with this all layers, St. Michael. Once again, thanks for watching, though, and have a blessed evening.